How's it going everybody? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be showing you how you can transfer your pictures and videos from your iPhone to your MacBook Pro. Now, depending on how many pictures and videos you want to share from your iPhone to your MacBook Pro, you can literally follow two different ways. Now, if you have limited pictures and videos, then you can follow wireless way. Or, if you have more than let you have a countless photos and videos that you want to transfer from your iPhone to your MacBook Pro, then you can use your cable to do that process. Now, before you do anything whatsoever, please be sure that you're up to date. Now, on our iPhone, we're using iOS 15. However, on our M1 MacBook Pro, we're using the macOS Monterey. Now, let's get started. First of all, if you have limited pictures and videos in your iPhone and that you want to share to your M1 MacBook Pro, the first things you have to do is just go ahead and open up your control center and then go ahead and tap and hold it right here and now tap on your AirDrop and make sure to select everyone and do exactly the same process on your MacBook Pro. Click on your Finder and now click on your AirDrop. Now on your ad drop, make sure to choose your allow, click on here and make sure to select it everyone. Well, once you have selected everyone for your both device, now go ahead and open up your photos and choose your pictures and videos that you want to share. Tap on select and choose your pictures and videos and afterward tap on share button. And then you're going to be able to find out ad drop. Tap on there and now you're going to be able to find out your Mac right here. So tap on there and afterward you're going to receive every single pictures and videos that you got right here. Now if you want to find out your pictures and videos, you want to click your finder and simply click on download and these are the pictures and videos that we have received from this iPhone. Now let's say you have countless pictures and videos. Let's say you have thousand or more pictures and videos on your iPhone. Now you want to share them to your Mac from your iPhone. Now what would you do? Now to do this process, the first things you have to do is to connect your iPhone to your M1 Mac with the lightning cable. After connecting your cable with your iPhone, if you get this pop-up where it says trust this computer, go ahead and hit trust. Now go ahead and enter your device passcode to confirm it and now you're good to go. Now just go ahead and open up your settings. Scroll down to your photos applications, tap on your photos, now scroll all the way down to your transfer to a Mac or a PC, make sure to place it keep original if you want to just transfer your original pictures and photos and if you don't want to change the format. After just putting the keep original, get out of here. Now the first place you want to go on your MacBook Pro is the spotlight search. Once you're here, now type image capture. Now open this up, click on right here. And now you're going to be able to see your iPhone right here. And after that, you're going to be able to find out every single videos and pictures that you might have on your device. Okay. Now you can just make it small to see all these pictures at once. And now you can download all of these pictures directly from here on your computer. You also can select them if you want. So you can hit command and hit A and then you're just going to just select all of your pictures and videos. Okay, well now for sake of this video, I'm just going to go ahead and select some random pictures and videos to show you how it really works. So let me just click on this video as well. So now if you want to just get these pictures, you can simply hit download. Plus, you also can choose your import too. I mean, where you want to save your pictures, you can choose a desktop, document, movies, download, especially wherever you want. So I'll click on others. You can create a folder and you can create it anywhere you want. So I'll choose a desktop here. Now I'll type photos and a folder has been created. I'll click on choose and now I'll click on download. And as you can see now it's importing your pictures and videos right away. And once it's done, you're going to be able to find out a green mark icon. That means this picture has already been imported to your device. Now if I click this photo here, now as you guys can see these pictures and videos now has been downloaded or imported to your Mac. So this is really simple and easy things that you can do, especially if you want to get all of your pictures or videos directly from your iPhone to your Mac. Alright guys, so this is how you can transfer your pictures and videos from your iPhone to your Mac without even installing third-party application and this is how simply you can do it. 
Hope you find this video useful. If so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later.